Hi, good evening to you both. Yeah, this group was featured in a YouTube documentary that was released last week showing how easy it is for them to steal Kias and Hyundais here in our state. Now, police, Hyundai, and even our attorney general tell me they are aware of videos just like this and are doing whatever they can to stop this criminal behavior. <laughs> A 44-minute documentary showcasing a group of young men allegedly stealing Kias and Hyundais across Connecticut. Go get you any flathead, any USB cord, and go get you any car you want. Is now going viral. We showed the video to Sharon Wardle and Matthew Mann of New Jersey, who owned this 2015 Kia. I don't know how they're going to stop it. It's hard. The trend started on social media back in 2021, originating in Milwaukee. Then it hit the rest of the Midwest and the Northeast the hardest. It's really been fed by social media, by teenagers seeing other teenagers uh, steal a car and then shoot video of themselves uh, in the act of the crime. James Bell with Kia America says only models from 2011 to 2021 with a steel key that goes into the ignition can be stolen this way. So last year, the company created a software upgrade for those models. If you have the software upgrade uh, installed in your vehicle, if somebody does go through that trouble, uh, the alarm system will run for an extended period of time and the ignition system will be defeated. The upgrade is free to all Kia owners available at their local dealership. But Connecticut's Attorney General William Tong says more needs to be done. There has been some response and they have taken some action, but clearly it's not enough. This is still happening. Tong is leading an effort with other states to investigate the company's response to this issue. We're going to hold them accountable and make sure they do everything they can to make these cars safe. And Tong says until they do it effectively, things like this will continue to happen. Yeah, <laughs> I'm not surprised. They're probably young enough where they're not going to get prosecuted or because right. they're still teenagers, not 18. Or now, the Connecticut State Police a spokesperson for the Connecticut State Police says that they are obviously aware of these videos and are investigating it all with their federal partners. Now, in the meantime, as I just mentioned in my story, if you're a Kia or a Hyundai owner and you have a model from 2011 to 2021, go get that software update at your local dealership. Even in these videos, the Kia boys admit that in some cases it's stopping them. We're live here in Milford tonight. Julia LeBlanc, Fox 61, Connecticut's news station.